Hello everybody, my name is Heather and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing something a little fun and different. So this is basically how I used to do my makeup slash more specifically how I did my makeup in high school. And I'm also wearing a dress that I have worn or that I have owned since my junior year of high school. Although it's it's pretty low cut. I used to always wear a teal like camisole with it because my boobs used to be a lot bigger, which is also funny because I don't fill out this top like I used to. And I'm also wearing the same barrette in my hair. I hope I got that in the shot. But let's just get started. So, I am using the Sephora brand foundation, but in high school, and actually recently, um, I would have used the L'Oreal True Match foundation, but I don't have that right now, um, so I'm just gonna use this. Now, I just put it on with my hands, and I'm gonna do two whole pumps, because I had really bad skin. Oh my god, this feels so weird because I put this on with a beauty blender now. Oh my god, I don't even know what to do with this. Okay, anyway. And I was never very good at blending it like all the way down my neck, so I usually had a line. So yeah, I'm pretty much, I have no face, no definition to my face right now. You'll also notice I'm not touching my brows. Oh my god, where is my face? <laughs> this is so much, but it's true, I needed full coverage, so. There we go. Um, I did not set my face with powder. I did nothing to my brows. And I'm noticing that's kind of a theme. Like no one did anything to their brows. Doing your brows was not, was not a thing. I'd always get like foundation in my eyebrows like I, I have right now. And I think I would just kind of like wipe at it. Okay, so that's product number one done. Now we're gonna do my eyes. So I actually just looked for my original eyeshadow. I used to have three eyeshadows and they were all little single eyeshadows from Ulta, like the Ulta brand. And I had a light icy blue, a white, like a kind of shimmery white, and then a shimmery black. Those were my three colors to use. I always use the black, so I'm actually just gonna use my Urban Decay Naked palette because Creep in this palette is pretty similar to the eyeshadow that I would wear every single day. I did not use brushes. I used my finger, and I only put it on my lid. I tried so hard to be like gothic and punk, I thought they were kind of the same thing in high school, so I was like, I'm goth, I'm punk. I love Avril Lavigne. She's so punk. <laughs> if I could, if my mom had let me, I would have wore, worn ties and like the little white tank tops that guys wore all the time under their shirts um, to school. That would have been like my uniform. All right, all right. God, it looks like I have a black eye. Okay, well, I would have done this anyway, so. There's all that excess foundation under my eye, so I'll just kind of use that to wipe it away. There we go. I have two different eyeliners here right now. I'll show you really the technique. I don't remember which eyeliners I used, but I definitely, I didn't do a wing. I literally just did the top line, and then I used eyeliner underneath my lower lash line. Okay, let's see if I can do it. Uh, underneath, oh my god. This is pretty bad. Ah! This is great. Oh my god, it's already <laughs> down. This is goth right here. Oh, emo. There we go. Emo. You Again, use that extra uh, foundation to help wipe away my black tears of emotion. Don't know what mascara I used. I'm sure it was some drugstore mascara. This is The Rocket by Maybelline. Second to last step is blush. This is the actual blush that I used. Not the actual, actual blush. It is the same brand, the same color, but yeah, that'd be weird if I had that for like 10 years. Anyway, but it is, I picked this one not because I liked the color, but because my L'Oreal True Match foundation was an N2, and this says True Match N1 or 2. So I thought that I had to go with this one. I did use a brush for this. I know that I did not use my hands. Oh wait, I didn't tap off the excess. I was almost, I was gonna tap off the excess. I did not do that, so here we go. But no, no bronzer, no contour. Contour was not a thing in my world. Last step, this is the lipstick. This is Clinique lipstick, 
in Plum Brandy. I did wear dark lipstick with black eyeshadow, so here we go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Okay, so here's here's the eye look. You know, so beautiful. Oh yeah. Oh, here's the lips. Mm-hmm. 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 So good. Now I'm gonna do something a little fun. First of all, these are earrings. That has that is Zach Efron on those earrings right there. I was obsessed with Zac Efron, I was obsessed with the movie Hairspray. I was very into musicals and everything. I was a theater kid, so I was in Claire's or Icing, I don't remember, with my mom, and I saw these earrings, and I'm like, Mom, you have to get me these earrings, and she said, you're never going to wear them. And you know what? I was like, I will. I will wear them every single day. And you know what? I wore them every day for like three months. I was kind of going through Facebook and looking at some old pictures, trying to get some inspiration for this video, and I found, uh, I found a couple of uh, interesting, interesting photos. So I'm gonna pop one here so you can kind of check that out. Look at that in its beauty and glory and emo everything. What can I, what? I'm gonna go ahead and put another one. Here's a different one. You can kind of get an idea of um, this photo shoot that I did. So, I don't know, I was a little inspired. And I'm like, Heather, what the hell were you doing putting eyeliner right here? Oh yeah, this is the most emo. Okay, and then finally, because I was poor. I couldn't get false eyelashes. Here we go, this is what I did. I did this. That's real. Gotta make it match. Gotta make it match. Eyeliner. This is the final look. So, so emo. And punk and goth, all three because they all meant the same thing to me. That is it for this video today. I hope you enjoyed seeing how I did my makeup in high school. So cute. So here are a couple more pictures of me in high school that you might enjoy. Boom, boom, boom. I don't know how I'm gonna edit this. Anyway, again, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I hope it gave you a good laugh. If you like me and you like this kind of thing, you can go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos. I post a little bit of everything. So if you subscribe, I will see you in my next video. And if you don't subscribe, then I'll cry black tears of pain. Hey, so um, I've already finished filming, but it's been like a couple of minutes and I wanted to show you that this eyeshadow, let me zoom in, is already creasing because I didn't ever put primer on in high school. I did not know what that was. I just wanted to share that with you. Okay.